Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Plants vs. Zombies. We're still in the pool, but not for much longer. Ah, uh, but now we're gonna have some trouble, I think. Because we have a few... ...problems to take care of. We have balloon zombies, we have pogo zombies, buckethead zombies. We're probably gonna want to have... Uh, the lantern and... ...the magnet shroom. But we're also probably going to want something to take care of anything in the air. Which might be just good to have a blower for. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Well, I think having the, the magnet shroom would be good just to remove the pogo stick and the helmet. But the balloon zombie... I think I'll just do cactus for because I've already got the lantern that I plan on setting out there. So I'm just going to go with this, I guess. Uh, and I guess I'll take the pumpkin as well, since we kind of... We should probably use that at some point, just to make things work better for us. Anyway, let's go. Let's put that in there. And hopefully... We'll be alright, but I want to use the, the pumpkin for... Upgrading stuff like the... The plantain and the magnet shroom, possibly. It would just be good to have the extra health on those. We have two waves of zombies in this level. But hopefully we'll be alright. Where are you? I think you're there. I was correct. That was where the zombie was. I don't know how I could tell that. I somehow could I knew it was on the top of the screen, but I couldn't see where it was because it was behind the fog. Which meant that it had to be in that column. You can see that one though. Okay, we almost have a basic setup. Almost. But we're gonna need a lot of sun for our cactuses. Unfortunately. So let's see how that goes. I can see that zombie there. Why can I see that zombie? The fog parted for a little bit. I'm tempted to start placing out... ...the things. The plantains. But I'm not sure if that's a great idea. Quite yet. Okay, how about we do this? Okay, there's a... ...cone zombie. We need to take care of that. But we also need to get... Um, the cactus. We need the cactus. So let's work on that. Ah, uh, let's put that in there. Let's see if we can put in the second plantain. Maybe. Soon. Ah, uh, plantain there. Cactus there. We need to protect those, but we also need to make sure that nothing can fly over the top of us. Ah, but I'd also like to put in a few other things like that. This is the way I normally set up this setup with the plantain in front of the magnet shroom. Oh, hello. That's not good. In the water there. I didn't mean to put that there. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Just need more sun. There we go. If we can get enough sun, we can also start putting the pumpkins on things like the plantain, probably. Okay, let's put that there. We're doing alright, but we could be doing a little bit better than this. Just a little bit. We're a little bit behind because of sun. But we're up to the first wave. Don't eat that. Why? Need the plants to be stronger. Uh, I have a feeling there's going to be something bad. You know? I have a feeling there's going to be something bad. And it's going to be in the one lane that I can't do anything about. Possibly. Uh, pumpkin. Get rid of that bucket head. Okay. 
Okay, the last cactus. Now we can actually start setting up more rows of them to be more efficient and just better in general. Get rid of that flying zombie. Put in some more stuff. Oh boy. I need to protect. Oh boy. Don't eat that. Okay. Give me more sun. Okay, there we go. Just want to protect those two columns more because they have the plantains in them. Okay, zombie with a bucket head. I like having the um the puff shrooms out in front as well, just make sure that the zombies take longer to get through. But I think we're looking pretty good now. Also, I think that balloon zombie, if it fell in the pool, just was gone. Quite possibly. But I think we're good now. We're getting close to the third wave. Just need to wait a little bit more. And then we'll be done. Although I'd like to put in some more other things as well. Also, I think if I dig up this plant, it'll be... Oh, I can choose. Okay. It actually highlights what I want to take out. Although I think I need to be very specific with that aiming. Also, the pumpkin takes a while to recharge, apparently. Just a little bit. But here we go, final wave. Not gonna be symmetrical anymore. There was a poker zombie, but we took him out. So that's good. It can be symmetrical if there's a gap. That's how it works. I always need that there though. Oh hello. Oh hello. Okay. He took his helmet off. Took a while though. Oh don't eat that. No. It's fine, I'll get rid of that then. Okay. That should be good. Let's pick up the note. See what it says. Hello, this is your mo mother. Please come over to my house for meatloaf. Leave your front door open and lawn unguarded. Sincerely, Mom. Not the zombies. <laughs> sure, I believe that. It's raining. Why did it get so dark all of a sudden? This can't be good. Oh well, hope you survive the night. Thanks for the help. Okay, so it's it's a storm, and now we can only see when the lightning flashes. Okay, um, I'm gonna wait for stuff to appear. This is kind of spooky. I like this. There's no music though, and I'd like that. Let's do that there. It's not exactly perfect, but it's a good start. Do one there as well. Get both sides somewhat evenly. Magnet shroom, where do I want to put that? I guess it depends on where other stuff will appear later on. I'm not sure how to place stuff in while this is happening. Can I see please? Please let me see. Okay, there's nothing that bad yet. Although I might be in trouble with these zombies getting closer. Possibly. I can't see what's happening so it makes it difficult to know if I'm winning. Also, I think I just saw a cone zombie. I saw several cone zombies. Oh no, they're going fast. They're going fast. Eat this. I can't see. And I need better stuff right now. Uh, let's do magnet shroom there. Cactus there. Magnet shroom there. Uh, pumpkin there, pumpkin there. I don't know if that's the right spot, but I'm going to check. That's not quite right on the bottom row. I, I'm surprised that worked on the top row, but not the bottom row. Okay, let's put that lily pad in there. Another star. Let's put in some more stars back here, just to make sure nothing can pass through. I really like being able to see, which is a shame for right now, because I can't see... Probably doesn't matter where I put the pumpkins, as long as I put them in. They should be correct. I can't see. 
lily pad, please. Okay, thank you. There, and then that one there. Double lightning, good stuff, so I can actually see for a little bit. Star in there. This is so hard to figure out what's happening, because I just can't see. I like how peaceful this is, even though it's crazy. I like everything that's happening right now, and also hate it at the same time. Oh dear, there's a lot of stuff in the pool. Uh, I might hold on to this lily pad. <laughs> Gonna try and get something else. First. First wave of zombies. First of two. Let's see how this goes. I can't tell if my defense is doing well right now. Just gonna put that in, why not? Uh, I might blow over. I don't think I need to at this point. Oh no, Jack in the Box zombie. Oh boy. I think that's a metallic, so if the thing was at, uh, awake right now, that'd be good. I guess. Okay, I can't see. I'll place this in, in any way. There. I think so. Just put stuff in wherever I can. At this point, oh boy, there's a lot of stuff. And there's gonna be stuff coming from behind us, but that's okay because we have so many stars. So that should... Oh boy, oh no. Did I get him? We got him. Oh, oh, that was not good. What was just happening was not good. There was a... Poker stick zombie that made it through. Let me put in another one of those. Hopefully that will be defended enough. Put in a star. Probably doesn't matter where I put stuff at this point. But hopefully we'll be alright. Okay, interesting. Very interesting. Let's put the star there. Cactus there. It looks pretty good when I can see it, but not perfect. And it has to be perfect. Uh, let's do that one there. I don't think we've had too much trouble with the zombies getting past anything. But then again, I can't see what's happening, so it's difficult to judge. Uh, let's put that there since there's nothing there other than the pumpkin. What's being eaten? Oh, hello. That zombie came out of the ground. Okay, good stuff. I still can't see. We also don't need these many blovers. Let me get rid of some of those. It might have been a mistake, but we still have two more. We have plenty. But okay, here's the final wave. Is there anywhere I can plant this? Possibly not. Oh, there it works. Okay. Just defend everything. This is the final wave, so it doesn't matter where I do this stuff at this point. I think we're good. I don't even care about the symmetrical because I can't see it anyway. But there we go. And that is the pool complete. And we get a cabbage poult. Hell's cabbages at the en enemy. Which is probably a good thing because now we're here. Whoa, they even found a way onto your roof. Those are some persistent zombies, dude. You need to use, uh, cabbage poults here due to your roof's angle. Remember that, and you're good to go. So basically, cabbage poults are the equivalent to pea shooters, but they have to be used on this level because the pea shooters can't shoot at the, at the angle of the roof. Uh, but anyway, it's daytime again, and there's also another problem with being on the roof. It's not, it's not exactly lawn. But it's probably fine. Let's do that. Let's grab that. Grab some extra stuff. Might be good to have a chomper. Uh, and it might be good to have... No, I've already got a walnut. Might be good... I don't even know what to do. A jalapeno. Maybe. Possibly a pumpkin. Let's do that. Let's see how this goes. So, the only place we can plant is on these pots here. And these pots can also be eaten, so we need to protect them. You can see they have a little face on them. It's so nice having more sun just falling from the sky again. 
Pretty nice. Okay, where is it? I don't have any more rakes. I probably should go buy a rake. Probably. It's just gonna take a bit before we get to that point, though. Have to survive this first. I'm glad that that potato mine will still work. Even though it's in a pot. Okay, there's a zombie up there. Please give me more sun. I guess that's good enough. I'll start defending other places what we, with the other sun that I have. Okay. And the next, next zombie will spawn in three, two, one. And where is it? There it is. So let's defend that row. I'm not sure if it's better to defend front or back at the moment with what we currently have. Because either way, there's plants out the front being the pots. That, that's the that's the only place we can plant stuff, so we need to probably defend it better. But we could also put other stuff in it to defend it. So, like we can put in walnut or we can put in a pet potato mine. There's just so many different things we can do right now. Uh, I'm also going to see if I can get more sun. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to save up and let's do that. Okay. Let's see what's next. I think we can start planting some other places. Since we have plenty of sun, we have to wait for... ...that twin sunflower to recharge. Oh, please be good enough to defend that. I could just put a potato mine there just in case, but I don't know if it's going to charge in time. Oh, that's not good. Put something on that. Because these zombies here will take whatever's on that spot. And if it's just the pot by itself, they'll take that. So we want to make sure there's something on that spot just to make sure that, that we don't lose that spot on the roof. So, it's a bit of a waste of sun, but that's uh, it's probably better than losing that entire spot. Make another more sun. And let's see if we can take out these zombies. Okay, that's two rows of cabbage poults. We should be good for a little bit, but I don't know what other zombies there were that are gonna attack us. We could also set up a row of chompers, possibly. But here's the wave of zombies, so we're at the end anyway. Oh, they're gonna take my thing. They're gonna take my twin sunflower. Also, they drop in some extra zombies. At the end. Or at least in the thing. They just they just sometimes drop more zombies in. Basically. Uh, but anyway, I can't get the symmetrical, so that's fine, I guess. Now we just need to wait for the zombies to get into position. And in, in position, I mean just the end. Come on. Eat, eat, the, eat, eat something, I dare you. Oh, there you go. You're gone now. Anyway, we get... A new plant, which is of course the pot, so we can actually start planting those now for 25 sun. Which will allow us to plant on the roof. Hey neighbor, got some uh, new items for sale. Well that's good. Uh, oh, we need to have, we need to buy these roof cleaners. But I, also, I don't have enough money. There's also some other stuff here. Uh, this is a spike rocks, which is an upgrade to the spike weed, which need, we need both to plant, of course. And also the magnet shrooms upgrade with gold magnets. Same stuff applies. I'm pretty sure... I don't think this one needs to be planted on anything, but everything else does, so... Anyway, let's buy the rake, and let's hopefully not run into any trouble with the zombies, because if they make it to the end, they win. Oh, this is fun. Ah, uh, let's do that, 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 that... That, that. We can also use the pumpkins as makeshift walnuts. Also, they cost as much as a tall nut, which is interesting to me. It's very interesting to me. I might actually switch that out and go with tall nuts. Also, tall nuts and pumpkins are really good together. Um, so... 
Let me grab chompers. And I really don't think there's anything else I can grab. Also, we can't use the torch wood and cabbage pot together, unfortunately. I can't think of what else I want to grab, so let's just grab a squash, I guess. Let's go with that. But here we go. That's where the first zombie's going to come out of. So we know this first zombie's taken care of. We can probably spend a bit longer getting sun at the very beginning then. Just a little bit. Nice tie, by the way. Okay. This is the first zombie. Now we have to spend a little bit more sun to get more sun. But that should be fine. Let's do that. Now we just need 150, which shouldn't take too long. We're already halfway there. Just another 50. One more. There we go. Get more sun. It's just going to be a shame when we lose that plant now, if we do lose it. Which we can probably stop it if we use something like a trap or something similar to it. Um, let's put that there, take care of that. And we can pl like we can plant outwards now because we have the flower pot. But we probably want to take it slowish. Slowish? I don't know. We also have... Oh, interesting, interesting, interesting. I'm probably gonna, gonna take you out before you do any difficult things to me. We also have two waves of zombies to worry about in this level. Once we get there. I also want to upgrade my sun. Let's, let's do that. Potato mines are so useful for setting up. Oh, here comes more zombies. But they're gonna be taken out by the cabbage poults without any problems. So that is good. I want to try and push over this way if I can. Oh, that's that lane. Interesting. So interesting. Uh, I, uh, uh, do that. <laughs> That'll work. Not very well, but it'll work. Oh, please take it out. It's fine. I'll just wait. I'll just wait. It's a shame about that pot, but I'll wait. It's a shame about that potato mine, but I'll wait. <laughs> it's fine. Oh, here comes more zombies, and they're stronger now, so we're gonna be in trouble. Come on, sun, I believe. I want more twin sunflowers. Here we go. Let's do that. Let's fix this up a little bit. We can leave that out there, which is good. Might actually be able to use it later on. As long as it doesn't get destroyed. Oh, no. Let's get rid of you. Good stuff. It's, I guess it's a good thing having these catapults attack from above, in a way, because it means we can... We don't have to actually hit the zombie that we've already taken out. Just before it gets... Falls over, I guess. Well, there goes that pot. Lasted its whole five minutes. <laughs> I don't know. How long it's actually been? Probably not that long. But anyway, here's our first wave of zombies. Come on, sunflowers. Nice. No, not that one. Anything but that one. Like, that one would be good. Well, we're gonna have to fix that then. Might not be worth... You know? Might just be better to just leave them as regular sunflowers. Ah, uh, never mind. I like it the way it is. Oh, this is not good. It's fine, I'll fix it, I'll fix it, I'll fix it, I'll fix it, I'll fix it. I will fix it. Please. Thank you. Oh, bucket zombie. How we missed thee. Let's do that. If possible. This is why we want the chompers, probably. I need so much more sun right now. It's not even funny. Oh, pole vaulter. 
Sun, 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 sun. Stuff recharge faster. Jump over that. There we go. The sun is so slow now. There we go. That's more balanced now. Still need more sun, but for the most part, we're good. Why would you take that? No, that's probably better than the other stuff you could have taken. I'm grateful for this. Look at this. Nothing ever happened. Could have been somewhere else though, but it's fine. It's better than wasting a ton of sun. No, not that there. Okay. This should be good now. Just want to get some more other stuff in because these pole vaulters are getting to be annoying. Come on, sun. And also seed packet. Oh, you took out the one flower pot that I needed there. That's fine. We have all of the double or twin sunflowers now, so that's good. Now I just need to plant some more chompers and then maybe some toll nuts if possible. But we are at the end, so that's probably not going to happen. Have to wait for sun and also seeds to recharge. You're taking out that? Okay, interesting. Oh, good stuff. The chompers were actually really good for that part of the end. Okay. It's gonna be symmetrical at least. Once we take out these last zombies. Oh, no, don't eat that. It's fine. It has to be symmetrical. Don't do it. Thank you. Symmetrical! Let's go. And now we get the kennel pult. Flings corn kernels and butter at zombies. So basically it has a chance of throwing butter instead of a corn kernel and it will stop the zombie for a bit. I don't think it's as strong as the cabbage pole, but it's good to have both of these. So it's a good combination of things that we have now. We also have the ladder zombie, which will place a ladder to climb over some things like possibly the toll nut. I'm not sure if it works for the toll nut though, possibly, but that's there until we take out whatever it's going past, I guess, so. Um, potato mine, toll nut, and... Trumper. Let's see how this goes. Let's plant. Also, I just realized that we don't get the bonus for not using up the lawnmowers. Because we haven't got the upgrade for the thing that is basically the lawnmowers. For the, because we don't have the roof cleaners. That's just weird, because you have to buy the upgrade to get the money. That's just such a interesting thing. It's not exactly what you'd expect from this. No, I missed. It's fine. Apparently if you miss, it just cancels anyway. Let's use a corn. Sun. How do I not have enough sun right now? I should have just placed a potato, potato mine. There we go. That's what it looks like when you butter them. It just completely stops them. Which would be good for when there's a lot more attacking, but it doesn't do as much damage, so... Two waves of zombies, but we're gonna be good. Probably. It's nice having this slow down at least so I can actually get some other stuff done. Like we can do that now. Oh, hello. Well, it's a good thing I can slow you down because you won't make it as far, I guess. So it has a chance of being better than just uh, a cabbage pulp, but it's, yeah, it's, it's a hit or miss, basically. Perfectly describes itself. Okay, let's do that. We have an average defense right now. Let's see if we can do better than that. So I'm going to put the chompers in a lot earlier. 
Because I think having three rows of carriage pots was more than enough, probably. Now, can I get enough sun right now to get more sun? That is my question that I have. Just a little bit more, please. One more. Please. There we go. Let's upgrade you. For giving us enough sun. Good stuff. Good stuff. All good stuff. I think I'm going to be concerned when there's the ladder zombies. Possibly. Because I think that's going to change the way we do this. Okay, good stuff. Now to work on chompers and toll nuts. Let's see how that goes. But I might be working on another twin sunflower first, if I can. Although we're getting up to the next wave, and something bad could happen when that happens, so I'm going to just hold off for a second. Unless I just get enough sun anyway. Which is always possible. Okay, let's see what happens. Will it take something that I want? Or will it take something that would be okay? And the answer is... Uh, anything? Looks like we're good. Let's put in another twin sunflower. And keep building from there. Oh, here comes that guy. Let's try and block him and see if this works or not. Hopefully the chomper will just take him out. Never mind. That's not going to happen. Uh, he's through. Also, he, mo he moves very quickly with the... Everything. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't eat the pot. <laughs> Anything but that. Oh, boy. This is not good. Uh, let me do that. Enjoy the sun in your face. <laughs> Maybe I'll have two rows of chompers and then then the toll nuts. The toll nuts actually didn't really block anything, so it might it might just not be worth it. Possibly. Uh, if I can get enough sun right now, I might be able to get some more sun. If that makes sense. So let's do that. Also, we're just going to get rid of that, I think. It's not worth saving. Let's put in more chompers instead. Okay, good. Okay. We have a row of chompers now. Maybe, I've, maybe I could have done more kernel pulps. Also, how is this producing sun for me right now? How is it doing so well out there? If I have more kernel pots, it means there's a higher chance of the zombies slowing down. Come on, sun, I believe. Let's upgrade that so we can get more sun. That should be everything. We're, we're approaching the last wave, so... I'm kind of happy with this, how it is, as long as nothing gets destroyed. Let's do that. I'm gonna work on another row. Possibly. See how that goes. Come on, take him out. Take him out. No, I just planted that. Okay, good. I was concerned for a second, but it's fine. Whilst well, so we're about to do the final wave. In a minute. Have to wait for these zombies to get taken care of first. There we go. Oh, 
Come on, more sun. Okay, what's going to get taken out as well? That's my other question. Hopefully it's something that's... Oh, there they go. Actually, not taking anything out. Maybe they, were, maybe they just weren't in this level. Possibly. I just didn't realize it. Okay, thank you. This is going well. I don't even think I need to do anything else. But I'll keep watching to make sure. I think the chompers are going to clean up nicely, so... Yeah, perfect. 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 Absolutely perfect. But there we go. Oh no, the symmetrical. No! Why? Why? Anyway, we get a coffee bean. Plant it on a mushroom to wake it up. So now we can use mushrooms during the day, as long as we have this coffee bean as well. But anyway, that is it for now. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.